In September 2011, I was supposed to die. And that sounds really awful. See, like she said, I was diagnosed with Crohn's disease. And if you don't know what that is, that's totally okay because a lot of people don't. Crohn's is a disease of your digestive tract. Your body is basically waging war against itself and is planting landmines from your mouth to your butt. It's obviously as fun as it sounds. My Crohn's was contained to my small intestine. My doctor said it was Crohn's disease from hell, which was kind of offensive. I was diagnosed March 26, 2011, and they told me I had to be hospitalized for a week. I remember thinking, so I'll be in here during spring break? That seemed like the end of the world. Little did I know it was gonna get worse. I didn't realize how serious it was, but since that day, I have had 10 surgeries, two long hospital stays, and I currently have an ileostomy bag, which is an appliance on your stomach that your intestines drain into. I would show you guys, but that would get really awkward. <laughs> After my sixth surgery in August 2011, I hit one of my lowest points yet. I did not meet death up close during those days, but we sure became good friends. He held my hand and he said, on the other side, there is no pain and you will be free. And that terrified me. I didn't want to hold his hand. It was sweaty, gross, just like a seventh grade boy. <laughs> on September 9th, 2011, I was admitted for life-saving emergency surgery. And my surgeon, Dr. Lees, made a decision that changed my life forever. He removed the damaged piece of my intestine and outfitted me with my ileostomy bag. But even two days after, I still wasn't better. I had an oxygen mask, a pick line that fed, fed me because I wasn't able to eat. In fact, I dropped to 74 pounds, and I was hanging on to life by the littlest thread. My parents thought I wasn't gonna make it, but my doctors were determined to keep me alive. Here today, I am 126 pounds, and I have been in remission since October. So the question is, what did I learn from all this? And the thing is, I don't know. And I think I'll spend forever figuring it out. One thing I did learn is that life isn't black or white, and it's not even gray. It's full of wonderful colors you have to learn to appreciate. The entire time I was sick, I just wanted a role model with my disease who could tell me it'll be okay, who had a success story, who knew what I was going through and understood how much courage it takes for people like me and thousands across the world to face this disease. So I figured, why not become this role model? I want you to understand and know my disease. Crohn's has the most diagnosed cases in Canada. No one else should have to suffer. And there's so many ways you can get involved. One of the first things you can do is easy. Just Google it. And second, find out about the Crohn's and Colitis Foundation of Canada. They have amazing ways to get involved, including sponsored walks, barbecues, like they're amazing. But mostly, I want you to be aware. I want you to know what my disease is. What is Crohn's disease? I'll tell you, Crohn's is my disease, and I own all of it, but it no longer owns me. Thank you. <laughs>